<laughs> Welcome everyone to the Novacare Complex. Eagles insider Dave Spadaro along with Fran Duffy and a deluge coming down on Monday in South Philadelphia. So the Eagles moving indoors, but still a lively spirited and well, for some people, a productive practice. Yeah, it was, it was, I thought a very, very good energy level here on t Monday morning here at the Novacare Complex. And what really stood out to me, Dave, was really the play of the secondary. The offense was down there in a seven on seven drill down in the red zone. And this, the offense couldn't get anything done couple touchdowns, but overall, the defense really stood out uh, in Monday's practice. And really, used, three defensive backs really stood out to me. Avante Maddox, number 29, the rookie corner, was in the slot with the first team throughout the course of the day, was really active for the second practice in a row, made some interceptions, was very active at the catch point, got some balls on the ground. Then you look at second-year corner, Razul Douglas. I thought he really bounced back strong today on Monday, was really active on the perimeter, had a couple of really nice plays along the sideline. And then Trey Sullivan, the second-year safety, he was active not just at the catch point but also came downhill and, and put some pops on, on some ball carriers as well I thought it was really good to see those young guys in the secondary really stand out and Sidney Jones had yeah. a pick six late in practice you know for the Eagles offense they are going in against some very fast sticky defensive players Carson Wentz struggled on this day um, Nick Foles had a couple of throws but for the most part once again it was a defensive dominated practice and that's kind of been the theme of training camp friend the Eagles defense has led the way and then when the Eagles get into game situations the offense is moving the football yeah it's been really interesting just to watch those two sides of the ball really go at it throughout the course of the summer and then if I'm going to pick anybody on offense really it's Zach Gertz number 86 I thought he had a really strong day caught everything thrown his direction and was really really good at the catch point and then number two Shelton Gibson who just continues to build day after day and really I think is taking the next step as a route runner he had a couple of really nice well-run routes on the outside today during practice and in case you're wondering newly acquired Christian Hackenberg stood, watched, absorb, did not take yep. any reps. Joe Callahan still taking some reps behind Foles and Sudfeld, and as well as Carson Wentz. Sure. For Fran Duffy, Dave Spadaro, that's our practice report on this Monday. Thanks for joining us. <laughs>